In this video tutorial, I'm going to share with you how to use the complete Google Suite, the Google Suite including the Google Docs, Google Sheets, and Google Slides. This can be very useful to people who are, who are using Microsoft Office 365 to conduct most of their document formatting and writing, but Google Suite is very, very free to use share and reshare things with your friends you can work online you can collaborate with your friends and do so many more things so to get to google suite all you need to do is to start by coming to your browser you can browse them individually like docs.google.com to bring you over here and you see a bunch of things or you can go to the sheet which is the microsoft excel version you can come to docs.google.com forward slash spreadsheets and it's going to bring you over here or you can go to slides from docs.google.com forward slash presentation okay so you can learn um, i'm going to show you how to use uh, most of these features another alternative way to get to it you can get there from your email address once you open your gmail you can just come to these small google apps you can just click on it and you can come down and see them these are the google suites that we're talking about the docs the sheets and the slides you can click on any of them from here and you're going to have complete access to them okay so without taking much of our time let's get started well google docs is a very google office suite is a very very fantastic uh, tool that is actually for free for personal use only for business use you have to pay but for personal use it's quite free and you can see build your best ideas together in google docs you can collaborate online and do so much more it comes in with different kind of features you can write faster with built-in intelligence and you can consult uh, you can bring in collaboration and intelligence to other file types okay so you have different kind of files powerpoint excel and microsoft word okay so you can do more with add-ons there are a lot of add-ons that you can add in uh, work on fresh content, stay productive and even offline. You can work even offline. So security, compliance and privacy is secured here. So these are some of the various plans, uh, products that you can find in the Google Office Suite workspace. You have Google Sheets, Google Docs, Google Sheets, Google Slides. These are representations of Microsoft Word, Microsoft Excel and uh, Microsoft uh, PowerPoint. Okay, so you have in addition to that, you have forms, keep sites, and many more okay so but for now we are going to concentrate on these three which are the most important docs sheets and slide okay for business use is def uh, uses usd per month but for personal use which is the one we are going for is uh, free okay so for free personal use you have a bunch of these options you have 15 gigabyte of uh, google Dra uh, storage cloud storage and you have you can do Google Meet video conferencing with uh, a maximum of 100 participants. Okay, so let's check out the Google Google go to docs for personal use, which is uh, this this one. And over here you have the option to you can check from these three lines. You have a bunch of other features and options. For example, you can see the uh, the different features, okay? The docs, the sheets, the slides and forms. So you can navigate to each and every one of them from here directly by just clicking on these three lines. So let's say we start with the docs and we've got uh, a number of temp templates that we can start from. So once you open the uh, Google Docs, you can get there from maybe this from from these three lines or you can come to docs.google.com. Okay? So once you're here, you will be uh, hit with a start new a new document maybe from a template depending on what you want, is it a resume, is it a letter, is it a project proposal? You can all start from here these are templates and these are recently used documents from your computer it's going to capture that and you can see quite a lot of them but then let's say for this tutorial we are starting at the blank page okay so we'll click on this to start a blank page and once you're here the first thing you will notice is that you can start typing immediately here and uh, the first thing is to give this document a name you can rename it over here so let's just uh, call it public speaking Okay, so you give it a name and it's going to save this on your drive okay so it's going to save it to the drive you can always uh, visit it to check and you can mark this as a start document so you can easily find it even within the start document in your in your google drive so you can write anything as usual and you can call out people depending okay and you have a bunch of options over here from the ribbon you can type anything uh, whether you copy and paste or you type so let's say we, so let's say we type something welcome to epic mentorship please 
remember to subscribe so this is just something a text that we we'll just type you can select it and you can play around with the text over here we have the text editing features you can align center you can align right you can align left you can uh, kind of justify if you want you can change the you can change the line and paragraph spacing and you can change many other features just like the way you have in microsoft office you have equally have it over here you have the editing features you have suggesting you have viewing okay people who you, you want to collaborate with what can they do on this document okay so you have other options here you can undo redo you can print you can do all sort of things you can put in the textile normal text you can increase the size you can put headers and many more you have the font style and font types over here you're free to explore and check it out over here you have the file you can start a new document either it is a uh, microsoft word document from a template or you can start a spreadsheet or you can start a presentation or even drawing from here okay so you can open an existing document or make a copy of it and you can email this to someone email this file to someone directly or you can download on different formats pdf the docs format rich format or plain text okay so so much more you can move this file to another file or content or place in your google drive or you can move it to trash and so much more so you have the other editing features like copy and paste do and undo redo and view options you can customize this to your liking you can enable mode uh, editing mode and you can enable on the suggestive mode like we've explained you can enable full screen or show section breaks easily you can insert different kind of things from here you can insert upload a document an image from a computer from a uh, search the web to find a document the google drive or google photos or entire url and to capture that picture and you have tables you can insert different kind of tables using different kind of uh, rows and columns and, and all that you can insert all sort of things you can insert drawings also you can create a new drawing you can insert different kind of charts bar chart column charts line charts pie charts and many more or you can even insert from google sheets directly okay so you could bring in horizontal line dates footnotes special characters equations what watermarks and headers and footers okay page numbers you can add all that easily from here you have a bunch of formats okay text paragraphing you can uh, use the text features over here bold italic underline and so much more and you can equally do that using these various controls control b control i and control u just like the way we have it in microsoft powerpoint or microsoft office suite okay so you have a bunch of headers and footers and you have a bunch of tools spelling grammar word count and all that feel free to try it and see you can even do voice typing you can hit on voice typing and you can start typing so click to speak so let's say we want to type it here as soon as you identify the place you click to speak hello and welcome to epic mentorship please remember to subscribe to our channel and you can stop it right you can see this is you've just said something and it has written it for you you can do that consistently and continuously using your using this feature okay so you have uh, a bunch of features try other things you can do formats you can check out tools script editor preferences you can bring in different kind of add-ons do more with add-ons you can get add-ons and apply them here so one of the most important part of this uh, document google docs is that you it comes in cooperated incorporated with different kind of apps for example at the top here you have the calendar which you can easily use to check your activities and and your schedules for the day easily you can check based on your activities what and what do you have for today what and what do you have for the week you can even check out this is today monday i don't have anything maybe you can check uh yesterday what do i have you can see to to update it for over here okay and you can open it in a new fresh tab so you can have an idea of what and what do you have you can check on each day what uh what activity do you have and at what time easily okay and over here you have google keep also you can check out your document and data that you've kept because it kept because it will synchronize with your gmail address easily okay so you have the contacts maps and many more and you can bring in other add-ons also from here one of the key important feature of this is that you can share easily with your friends privately to your friends so that you, they can con con uh, they can contribute and collaborate with you while you are working on this very document so it's very easy to do that feel free to try it and experience it it's a very fantastic alternative to microsoft word
so let's say we are trying another option which is the so let's say we open uh, now spreadsheet and take a look at how it's going to look and as you can see it looks perfectly the way we want it to look because it kind of look the, exactly like the microsoft excel look okay it looks like exactly the like the microsoft excel that we have you see the cell arrangement okay and the different features okay the the file menu the same thing edit menu you can have the same editing features you can have the same view options okay you can have insert you can bring in different kind of cells you can insert cells uh, uh insert cells and shift shift right and insert cell and shift down okay uh you can insert rows you can insert columns you can insert sheets and even charts you can bring in pivot tables images and even drawings okay you have different functions you, have, you can check around over here and easily you can use them okay so you have formats you have formats over here you have different themes you can bring in and you can uh, text features different text features alignment and wrapping rotations of text and all that you can check around and see how and what you can do with your text and data data tab also contain all sort of things from create a filter to filter views add a slicer and so much more you can have tools over here you can create form that di forms directly from here you can do spell check and notifications and you have a bunch of other extensions that you can check around the macros and all that app sheets you can check and you have the help menu also that is available uh, at any given time over here to these tabs you have various bunch of features that you can use to plot your graphs and to edit your text and play around with the textiles and all that you just feel free to try it. these are functions that we've just explained you can just check check through it and see what and what you can benefit from and over here at the top you can share the document equally with people and you can upload and publish uh, you can present this using this icon to the people you can present using a meeting code usually on google meet you can easily present this on using the meeting notes so this is just the same way that you have the same way that we have in the microsoft excel you just feel free to try it and see what and what you can do how can you edit how can you play around with your document what benefits can you have so the same way we can try to open the google we we'll come back here and say to file and say uh, presentation instead of uh, spreadsheet you can say presentation and you have the looks just like the way you have in microsoft excel and you can you can do quite a lot with with these presentations as well so the same way you add slides the same way you add content to your slide the same way you change the theme the backgrounds the arrangement to see the slideshow virtually many many of those features are also available over here so one of the key advantages or additions that we have over here is a theme that's newly introduced you can see different kind of styles that you can bring into your themes to your slides so that they can kind of look much more professional and better so feel free to try it to explore and see so whichever one you click is going to take that as a template and you can you're free to add content accordingly and you can just type anything you want for example so many things you can write and you can customize this to your liking you can close this and you can check other features like the background the layouts you have different kind of layouts that you can bring in the themes that we just discussed transitions you have a bunch of transitions you can check uh, from here you can see a lot of them dissolve fade but the only downside of presentation is that the google presentation is that it doesn't have much of the animations uh, compared to what we have on microsoft office 365 and and all that okay so all all the features you can find them uh, virtually here you can have the view the edit feature the view feature the insert feature you can insert so many things accordingly just like we've explained the formats you can uh, play around with the text formats slides format you can uh, bring in new slide duplicate slide delete slide and and so much transitions you can apply you can uh, you can check out the arrangement order you can bring in top to bottom uh, tools you can just check out the spelling tools voice speaker also works here as well you can bring in different kind of add-ins and many more okay so feel free to try the google office suit including the microsoft including the docs the the sheets as well as the presentation they are very very good alternatives to microsoft office suit if you're tired of that you can do always use this and once you're done editing or presenting or uh, making your document you can always come to file and you can always download this in different formats that's one of the benefits once you download it in uh, in .ppt, this is going to open in the Microsoft PowerPoint anywhere you find yourself. Equally the same here, once you download in 
the docs is going to open in microsoft word equally and you can download even in pdf which can open virtually anywhere the same the same thing goes to this is uh, spreadsheet you can download in different kind of format dot xls or dot pdf okay or dot csv it's still going to open in microsoft office excel and and, and they are about so ladies and gentlemen this is just a bit about google office suit if you like this video please remember to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe and notification buttons to stay connected to this channel for more of our very very useful videos i'll see you in my next video bye